Before we uh, start our demo today, I have something I need to uh, talk about. Uh, what, whatever is left from last class, it's only a minor stuff. So in the last class, uh, what we were at the end of last class is we are trying to uh, like award the badges according to the achievement of that user of that player according to its score so um, what we have here is we have this achievement system so that when we're running this we actually kill something we will have those uh, badges but uh, we had a bug last time that's because when we are setting up the window the GUI we give a uh, same ID with the previous one with the scores window so it's here if you look at here the GUI window here is actually an ID so put, uh, be careful with that sometimes you just put everything as zero but sometimes if there are two windows on your screen uh, you kind of need to put different number give different number to that so see this simple stat tracker because we put it here we have window as the ID of zero so that uh, if we check both of this so we can have two windows appear without error but if you put the eight ID as the same it will have some problem there okay and uh, another thing here is yeah if you remember we use this for loop to create how many badges so we, we, we use a for loop to create badges according to its achievement level so if its achievement level is is four you can collect the four badges then we show four buttons uh, beginning in this horizontal area and also you need to give a define the height and the width of your button otherwise if you do not define that what's gonna happen you can see <coughs> if you do not define the uh, the height and width, what's going to happen is if you have one button, it will occupy the whole area, the whole area. But if you have two, it kind of squeezed in. So that's how it works. So if you want like every badges to be, if you want, if you're using a button as a simple uh, representation of your badges, you kind of need to define the uh, define the width and height. And sometimes you, most of the time, you won't use that uh, button because you are using an extra badge uh, image for the badges. So that. Yeah, that's you can define, you can manipulate, but the logic behind is the same. But just you, instead of create a button, you can create a button with image, with background image, or you can create a button, or you can create just uh, some label, things like that. The squee elements, you can play around with that. But the logic, just, just need to replace this statement. So that's it. Okay, so that's it uh, for what, uh, for this uh, scoring system. All right.